folks, welcome back to the Face Off All Star Season 11 vlogs. And this week around, they had a challenge of doing a coven of witches with a warlock. And the twist is they are given uh, a chance to pick one of the spell books of a certain list of items and readings used to cast a curse onto the other team. Uh, witches. It was interesting <laughs> to say the very least. Super team of Emily, Tyler, and Logan, their curse was their uh, witch. Two witches and warlock were slowly being turned into uh, trees and poison sap, and, and one agree was the breath of a dying man. So they incorporate those in their makeup, and then uh, super team Sig, George, Evan, and Ben, they had like metals and bo boils and rats. So they did like a, a one thing, which I'm gonna talk about that in a bit because people have struggled in this and I do mean that. Speaking of, well, Six Team, they struggled on day one. When Michael Westmore came in, he did not, they originally had a concept where they were uh, rat witches and people turning into snake people the curse because he had like a snake venom as an ingredient but Michael rest most more didn't like the idea and the whole team realized they weren't agreeing with it so on day two they scrapped their t concept and had instead be uh, a curse at turning the coven into uh, rats humanoid rats with, that are affected by the plague so it worked a lot better. I actually think that was a good idea that they scrapped the first idea and then went on with their second idea on the second day. And then only other person that struggled during the thing was Emily, she, which is rare. She does very well, but she wasn't liking her face piece. She was trying not to make it like a normal witch, which is understandable. <laughs> which is understandable. Huh. There was no best or worst category because there were two super teams doing like their own makeups. So we're going to talk about each of the teams with their makeups together. First up, we have uh, Team 1, which is Emily, uh, Tyler, and Logan uh, with their group. I love the concept. I love the Warlock's uh, makeup on his face. I love Tyler's, uh, which I thought it was wonderful. The weakest one, was, even though it was creepy looking, I think was Emily's. Hers was a little bit weak, but they read as though they um, were affected by the curse. And the one thing they put in their story is that e there are witches from different covens that have come together to fight in this war. So it meant that each witch was a different style tree affected by the curse, which I do like that. It makes them all different, but you know, they come together and they're all a coven. It was still an interesting concept and I enjoyed it. Then we got team two with Sig, George, Evan, and Ben with their concept. I freaking love this. I think it's amazing. I love the way they did the rat features. They were all creepy and rat-like. I love the hands, I love the faces. On two of them, the third one, which was done by Ben, it looked unfinished. It was missing boils, it was missing pieces, and during last looks, after applying the hands, Ben didn't have time to actually touch touch them, so he put fingerless gloves on the model, where the model already had the rat hand, silicone rat hands on them, but then they put gloves, he put gloves over them, like fingerless gloves, and I'm just like, that's not a good sign if you're putting it over, it's not good, and I'm just like, oh, it's not gonna be good, it's gonna be awful, oh. And who won? Well, by a landslide, all the judges loved this makeup from this one group. It was Tyler, Emily, and Logan. They love Tyler's design, so they won. Which means that Sig, George, Ben, and Evan are on the bottom. And the person who got eliminated, unfortunately, was Ben. But it's understandable because, like, Ben and Evan, when they were in the beginning, they were at the bottom, then they kept, were in the top, but then they kept cheating, not agreeing with ideas. It's understandable. Ben is still talented. He's very good, but I've learned that he, depending on who he works with, when it's with Evan, it, there's conflict. But when he was with Sig and George, there was a lot easier way for them to work together. So, 
I don't know. Uh, I hope know that Ben's gonna do pretty well. He's done pretty well. A lot again, this is all stars, so it's hard trying to really eliminate the best since they're still the best. And we got six people left, so it's still gonna be hard trying to find the, the best out from this. Or it's still gonna be hard trying to eliminate people. It really is, so we'll see how it goes. Next time my DR cut off and also it led into the uh, newest episode of Cosplay Melee, where they did Game of Thrones. I really should talk about that as a vlog series next for to do on this show. I'm not sure. I'm not on this show, but maybe a different vlog reactions. If you guys are interested in me uh, talking about Cosplay Melee, because so far it's been pretty good. But I don't know the next week. I can't even remember the title. So I'm gonna leave off saying we have six uh, contestants remaining on the two super teams. Who will be eliminated? What will the challenge be? And well, how are the makeups gonna fare? So until next time, folks, I will see you all in the face of All Stars Season 11 vlogs for next week. Later.